सो हाई गाइज इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट डेप फॉर सर्च बेसिकली इट इज ऑल्सो अ टाइप ऑफ अनगाइडेड सर्च और यू कैन से एज अन इनफॉर्म सर्च बिकॉज एट एवरी स्टेज देर इज नो पर्टिकुलर इंफॉर्मेशन गिवन इन विच डायरेक्शन वी नीड टू सर्च सो बेसिकली वॉट इज अ डेप फॉर सर्च डेप फॉर सर्च ऑलवेज एक्सपांड द डीपेस्ट नोड इन द करेंट अनएक्सप्लोर्ड नोड ऑफ सर्च ट्री बेसिकली दिस मीन्स सपोज यू आर इन द नोड वन देन यू विल सर्च इन द नोड टू देन इन द नोड फोर मीन्स यू आर गोइंग इन दिस डायरेक्शन एंड यू विल एक्सप्लोर ऑल द नोड फर्स्ट इन द डेप्थ फॉर्म आफ्टर रिटर्निंग यू विल अगेन फाइन दिस नोड एंड आफ्टर कमिंग बैक फ्रॉम फाइव you will move to the third node and in third node you will visit six and afterward seven so basically in dev for search all the successor nodes are searched first and after that the nodes are uh, searched so basically how dev for search is implemented dev for search is implemented using stack that is last in first out it is just like the keeping a book suppose you keep the first book then second book then third book then fourth book so when you want to read any on any of your book then first you will pick the fourth then third then second then first same is with this case suppose you are implementing it then eighth will be at the last but the, this node will be expanded or you can say this node will be searched first basically first second fourth eighth means you go in the downward direction to search the nodes then come back and then search the rest of the node now talking about the complexities basically complexity of dev for search is o b raised power d where b is number of nodes generated from each node like from this node two nodes are generating so for this node b will be 2 and d is the depth means like in this case case depth is fourth but time complexity of depth for search is less than time complexity of breadth for search because you don't need to store all the nodes suppose you are exploring the second node then you need to store uh, in the memory this node only you don't need to store 5 or if there was 3 so you don't need to store this in the memory and once you have explored all all the nodes then this nodes will be free so time complexity of the dev for searches less than that of breadth for search space complexity is same because if you are explore, exploring this node suppose you are exploring second node then you need to keep the node because if you have explored eighth but you have not explored the fifth node so you need to keep the second node also in the memory so space complexity of dev for search and breadth for search are almost equal but time complexity of dev for search is slightly less than that of breadth for search i'm not talking about what is the algorithm of breadth for search in breadth for search algorithm is dfs then you have to visit the node suppose visited node is 1 then from each node of vertex w from adjacent and v2 from v do this then suppose you are in this node suppose you are you were in the second node then adjacent nodes of the three are kept till you have not explored all the node means if visited w equals to 0 if you have visited this node then visit dfs of w means if you have visited completely this entirely node then you then you will visit this node means adjacent of this adjacent of 2 was adjacent of 3 so now talking about what are the advantages and what are the disadvantages of dev for search advantages of dev for search is it take less time to search for to search a element and it also takes slightly less memory and by luck answer is 
find in the first attempt. Suppose this was our tree. And you are searching this element. Then on first attempt, you can find this answer without like if you were in the breadth, uh, breadth first search case then you have to search this node and after that you have to search this node so in breadth first search in depth first search by luck and sometimes answer can be found in the first attempt this is one of its advantage it takes slightly less memory suppose you were searching this element and you have completely searched this element this part you have searched then this part will be deleted from the memory and only this part will be kept in the memory which you are searching suppose you have searched this complete part then this part is removed from the memory and this part is only left in the memory it takes slightly less time than breadth first search because when you are searching you are just searching on a particular depth of the node and you don't need to keep all the remaining part of the nodes so that's why it take less time now talking about the what is the disadvantage of the dev first search sometimes it may stuck in a loop forever suppose this was your goal node and you started your searching from this node because it is a dev first search first you have to search all the successor node and suppose these were the infinite numbers of nodes present here then it might be case it might be a case that you go forever searching in this node and you will never return to search in this so sometimes it may stuck in a loop and you will not be able to find the answer thank you